Hi and welcome to my playhouse and I have kind of an irritating project on the table right here and it's like a rotating saw you probably know what I mean this is a really cheap rotating saw uh, and it normally it goes like this I've taken it apart because it didn't work. First I took this apart and checked out the connection to the engine, but that, that worked okay. And then I took the handle apart and I found out that this one, the one that you press when you want to start it, it doesn't work. There's, there's like two connections. These two go together and these two go together. And I think it was these two, they don't connect. You can press as hard as you want, but they don't connect. So what I thought was, this is probably a cheap piece of junk. I can buy this off eBay. So I did. I tried. Oh. I tried to find it on eBay and searched for it, but I didn't find it. And that's kind of irritating because even though this is a cheap saw and not really that good, I really wanted this. I have another one, but this was this was a really good backup saw. Like right now, my saw is not at home. I have it's at my mom's place and uh, yeah I needed this today and I was actually trying to fix it but when when the problem was not in here I kind of gave up and then just half an hour ago I thought I'll take this apart and see what is in here and this is probably okay but this one is broken so I'll search some more and if I find something I'll get back to you. But um, that's just a quick update. Bad saw. Well, I found a switch. Um, oh, actually, I found I found six switches. that are only two dollars sixty-three cents. But you have to buy six of them. That's not that's not really a problem. But the problem is this amount, uh, $15.74. Uh, here in Denmark, if we buy anything from outside the EU with an amount over $15, we have to pay import tax. And that's not really that bad. But the post office, they take a fee as well. And that's about twenty dollars at least. So I have to find something that comes uh, under fifteen dollars. But the the switch is definitely on sale out there. So this is a small update. Update. Hey, so I've been searching the internet for this switch. And it has been a hassle. It's this is not easy to find on the internet. And I did find it as I showed you, but it was I could only get six pieces of it and the the postage and all the the hassle with the Danish post office would be too expensive. But now I have found it on eBay and I'm actually able to buy just one. Here it is, my switch. Oh, it looks very similar. I will just have to live with the bot. This, it's like a switch when uh, you're not able to press the big one. This one, you're not able to press that down unless you press this one. So, 
only one of the connections and this one is working right now and it really should it really should have two connections As so I'm gonna try to buy this one I think actually I'll try to buy two of them just uh, if one is bad this is like it it's like they cost 2.56 British pounds and the shipping is half a pound so it's it's not that bad it's what is that it's about five dollars or something like that so if I buy two it's about ten dollars that's probably okay and it's from something Asian Ashi Electric UK although it says it's gonna come from Hong Kong so uh, that's kind of I'm curious so but I'll buy one or two of these and I'll update you when they arrive it might take a while so I'm still buying it and the total for two of these switches will be six pound and twelve pennies I think they're called there and I'm having them sent to my address and it's gonna be a total of 57.82 Danish crowns and that is uh, just a little over ten dollars so we'll confirm and pay Processing, 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 yada yada yada, thank you for your purchase. I just turned the camera away, I was not sure what it was gonna show you. I'll get back. Well, I ordered the parts, but let's just say that this little project is uh, awaiting the, the spare parts from China. and. I have seen spare parts like this take about 30 days to get here um, so I'm gonna pack up this project until they get here um, and it's really stupid to have it laying around like this because then all the parts will be scattered away so I'll put it back together and but there's really no reason to to really assemble everything so I'm just gonna put it in and assemble assemble it loosely so that nothing disappears in that month or so. So I'm just gonna screw in the screws a little bit so that they don't drop out. Hopefully when the when the when the spare parts get here they will fit and I can repair my power craft rotating saw. That's probably gonna be that for this project for at least a month. So uh, if you have something that is broken and you think that it's easy to fix remember that you can almost always get some spare parts uh, on the internet sometimes you have to do a lot of searching because they may, might be rare but um, try the, the Chinese sites aliexpress.com I kind of like that one 
they have a lot of free shipping and you can buy something for uh, two three dollars and they'll bring it right to your door and that's kind of cool so um, thank you for watching that small video and uh, do subscribe to my channel and you will see me again have a nice day bye bye